Nashville, I'm Samantha DeBecary, your sports correspondent for what's going down in Bruintown. And I'm here with Drew Hanlon, a Belmont basketball player, senior graduating this year. And he wants to tell us a little bit about his business, Pure Sweat. So let's take a listen. Uh, Pure Sweat is basically an NBA training and consulting um, company. What we do is we take college guys and get them ready for the NBA draft, and we also take pro guys and break their film down and enhance their game through workouts. Um, we also follow them throughout the season and provide scouting reports, um, film breakdown, and tell them what they need to do um, after games. Okay, when did you start this business of yours? I first started training young players, like sixth graders, around the St. Louis area when I was a junior in high school, which was 2007, and, and I started getting pro guys two summers ago, and since then I've, I've built that up and then also gained a bunch of college interests um, from guys that are trying to get ready for the NBA draft. Is there a reason that you have such a passion for this business and you continue to do it? Definitely. It was something starting out. I just wanted to do it just because um, there was local players that wanted to know what kind of workouts I did. And then it grew into something that I knew I could do full time. I wanted to continue to be around the game of basketball, but I knew um, since I was a short white guy that I wasn't going to have a playing career. So I mm -hmm. thought that uh, staying in the training industry would be something that would definitely be good moving forward. And do you plan on continuing only this or do you want to expand it? Do anything more with it? Um, I'm definitely going to continue doing the training side. I'm going to focus primarily on NBA guys, but I also will do some camps and clinics around the world. I've um, been fortunate to go to four different countries and been in 38 states, so I'd like to expand that. And then also I have an iPhone app coming out this summer, which is kind of for players that don't have the chance to work with me on a daily basis, they can get the same exposure to the drills and skills. Cool. Um, do you want to tell us a little bit more about your app and when it's coming out and how much it is and everything like that? Um, basically the app's coming out in mid-July and it's going to have all the videos with the NBA guys doing the drills and skills and it's going to have a, our full workout curriculum so that they can follow the daily workouts that the, their favorite NBA stars do and it's going to be as cheap as a dollar a day. I'm not trying to make a bunch of money off it. I'm just basically trying to do it so those kids can have the same exposure and hopefully get better and make their teams that they're hoping for. And don't you have a website for Pure Sweat? Can you tell us a little bit about that? I do. PureSweatBasketball.com is the website, but um, most people follow me on Twitter just because Twitter is something that I can activate every day. I don't update my website too much, but my Twitter handle is PureSweat, so Twitter.com slash PureSweat, and that's where I post daily drill skills and teaching points that can help players improve. So how did you manage all of this with basketball and all these four, like within these four years? It was hard. The NCAA has a lot of rules where you can't use your name or image or anything like that, so I couldn't even have my name on my own website. But um, it just it, a lot of it was just ma managing my free time and making sure that instead of going and watching a movie or anything like that, I would, I would go and watch film and break down that and help my clients out. So a lot of it was just managing free time and making sure that I didn't waste a lot of time and, and focused on stuff that was actually going to help me and, and my company grow. Uh, what do you plan on doing with all your free time that you have coming up now, not being at Belmont? Anything more with the company? Well, I'll just continue to work out my clients. I've got a couple of college guys that are getting ready for the draft, so I'll be working them out twice a day, which is a busy job, and then also continuing to do the film breakdown stuff. So I won't have too much free time, but that free time I'll probably um, put into expanding the business elsewhere as far as PDFs, DVDs, and stuff like that goes. Can you tell us a little bit about your current clients that might be going to the NBA? Well, i got two guys that I really take care of right now as far as college guys. One of them is Bradley Beal at Florida, and then one of them is John Jenkins from Vanderbilt. Um, I'm actually getting ready to work out John here in a second, and I think you guys are going to have some access to that workout as well. well. Great. Awesome. Thank you. Can you introduce us to John, maybe? Um, John's hanging around right now. He's actually getting stretched out and getting ready, putting his shoes on and stuff like that, but I'll definitely be able to introduce you guys to him once we get the workout going. Okay, awesome. And maybe can you tell us a little bit about your current NBA clients? Um, the main guy I work with is David Lee, who's uh, plays for the Golden State Warriors, had a, a four-year run at, as a New York Knick. Um, he was an all-star there. And then I've also been doing um, some side projects with John Wall, who a lot of people are familiar with from his Kentucky days, who plays for the Washington Wizards right now. Awesome. Well, thank you so much. Again, this is Drew Hanlon, senior basketball Belmont player, and I'm Samantha DeBecary, your sports correspondent for What's Going Down in Bruntown. Have a good week.